This video will discuss the features that are designed to meet the second goal of GagePack. As we discussed in the first video, the second goal of GagePack is to keep users informed about upcoming Gage servicing activities, such as calibrations or maintenance events. There are several ways to approach this goal. First, note that the reports and filters mentioned in the previous videos are commonly used to generate lists of gauges that need some sort of attention. Many such reports and filters are built right into the program as defaults. The colors that appear on the gauges list serve as warnings to the user. Several of the colors indicate that the highlighted gauge is past due for some type of servicing. By default, a gauge colored as red is past due for a calibration event. Light blue is past due for an R&R study and light purple is past due for a maintenance event. The colors are easily adjustable by the user. Another tool that is useful for tracking upcoming events is the calendar. The calendar gives the user a bird's eye view of every event that needs to be performed within a given month. In addition, users also have the option of working directly from the calendar since each of the events listed are actually hyperlinks to the events themselves. For example, I can see that I had a calibration due on February 26th. If I double click on that day, I will zoom into a weekly view, and I can see that the calibration event has changed into a hyperlink. If I click on that link, I'll be taken directly to the event itself, and I can complete it as normal. Notice that once I completed the calibration event, the hyperlink no longer appears on the calendar. That is because the calibration event has been completed and GagePack has already scheduled the next calibration date for that particular gauge based on its calibration cycle. This means that a user can log into the calendar once per day and work through hyperlinks until there are none left. Then, they know that they have completed all of their scheduled gauge tasks. The To-Do List on the Tasks tab serves as the most powerful event manager. In the Tasks filter area to the right of the grid, the user defines which type of events they would like to see and how far into the future they want to look. This will generate a list of every upcoming event that meets the chosen criteria. Just like the calendar, the to-do list will be constantly updated as events are completed. Once the to-do list is empty, the user knows they have completed all of their tasks. In addition to the functions that are built into the main application, an add-on program called GageMail is available. GageMail is a Windows service that will constantly scan your GagePack database to watch for upcoming events, past due events, and failed calibrations. When it finds any of these, it will generate and send an email message to the appropriate person or people. Users can define how far in advance of an event alert should be sent, how frequently they should be sent, who should receive them, and what gauge information should be included in the message. This provides users with a fully automated reminder system that doesn't require anyone to log into GagePack or even the computer. These videos have been an extremely brief overview of the basic functionality of GagePack. If you would like a more thorough demonstration, or if you have questions about the software, please let us know. Thank you again for evaluating GagePack.